I have a letter here from Smitha Warrior. She says, the escape guide is a great idea and I would like to know more about it. Well, Smitha, here you go. If you have a religious streak in you, the escape guide has a host of pilgrimage possibilities this week. If you're in search of a spiritual experience and are an ardent nature lover, then pack your knapsack and get ready for a two-in-one experience. You have the Yamunotri and the Gangotri trails in UP with the nearest railhead at Rishikesh. Both these shrines which nestle in the lofty Himalayas are of religious significance and are considered vital pilgrimage sites. The echoes of sacred chants and temple bells have attracted millions of devotees over the centuries. Dharamsala in Himachal has the largest concentration of Tibetans anywhere in the world and is a popular pilgrimage site for Buddhists. For a change, you can try a human pilgrimage and bask in the sublime company of the Dalai Lama, who holds frequent public meetings here. Old Goa has a concentration of churches that attract millions of pilgrims from around the world. Visit the Basilica of Bomb Jesus, also a World Heritage Site, and combine it with a sightseeing trip to this quaint Portuguese town that will remind you of Lisbon. The Golden Temple. This is the fountainhead of Sikh religion situated at Amritsar, which means the pool of nectar where the young and old alike come from far and near to pay their homage. Do not forget the Mecca Masjid at Hyderabad. The mosque is said to have bricks from Mecca built into its central arch, hence the name. The summer may not be the ideal time to visit temples in the south of India, but come September and the temperatures begin to drop and you could be in for a treat. Perched atop the Chamundi Hill in Mysore is the ancient Chamundeshwari temple. If one has to reach there, one has to climb up a thousand steps. And for those who don't want to rough it out, there's a motorable road right up to the temple. The major attraction of this temple is the tall monolith of Nandi. No other Indian state is as dominated by temples as Tamil Nadu. Brihadishwara Temple in Tanjore is one of our most magnificent structures. Visits to temples need not be just the theatras, they can be thrilling trips to dreamy places as well. The pilgrim tale is yours to take. Now you know how. <laughs>